Hey guys, so I am actually on the way to the new Maniso store in Chicago. I'm actually coming on opening day and I drove past it and there's crazy lines. So wish me luck that this one actually has some Disney stuff in stores. I know a lot of them have like not as many things in the store, but it's mostly online. So hopefully I'll get lucky. And this is a very congested area. So this is um, like Chinatown in Chicago. So it's very, very busy. So we're gonna see how this goes. Come along with. Okay, so of course I had to start with the Toy Story section. There's the green alien. You have some plushies. And this is a crossbody bag that works as a fanny pack. Uh, some keychains. You have some pens, little wallets. And then, oh my God, Lotso throw pillow. Yes, please. And then you have ham and Lotso little like towels. And then that can of fanny pack thing. And then um, you have some keychains. This is actually like just a squishy thing um, with a pole. I thought it was a pen. This girl is always in my way throughout the video. So she's the life runner. Then you have some tote bags. Super, super cute. Of all the different Toy Story characters. Buzz Lightyear. And then um, she was in my way again here. I always try to look around me and make sure I'm not in anyone's way, but clearly there's a couple of people not like that. So you have um, Toy Story notebooks, little notebooks. Uh, these are some really cute little pouches. Um, I tend to... I will say it was so busy that I kind of wasn't really looking at prices a lot, especially stuff on tables. They didn't really have anything priced. Um, so this stuff is just kind of more stationary. Uh, they love a pen with a fun topper on it. So these are some other little fun things. So you could tell it was very, very busy on the first day. So um, these are just kind of pens, pouches. They have the minions. And then um, over here, they just had a couple of kind of like stationary things again, some sticky notes. On this side, um, some balloons for birthdays. So that's really cute. Around the corner is what I was waiting for. They're mystery minis. Um, these are very similar to the Pop Mart figures. Thanks for walking right in front of me. <laughs> um, so they have like the alien, green alien over here. They had the princess ones, which I thought were actually figures, but they're only keychains. Um, so, and then of course, some villains. I had to show the box to show you guys which options. Super cute. And um, I did like these still. They do look a little bit small, but I might have got some. Can you guys guess? And then just some fun AirPod cases and some hanging stuff. Some phone cases. A lot of Marvel, I will say. And more AirPods. So this section reminded me of Five Below a little bit. Like some headphones, which no thanks. Making my way over. These are some fun little treats that we might go back and like pick up a bunch of that stuff to try as a taste test these are kind of like old navy flip-flops wasn't that into it uh moving on over there's so many bucket hats but they are all disney so they're kind of cute still would never wear them and then high shoes which everyone seems to love they had some cute stuff over here some like traveling tooth brushes, some bins over here that you could put numerous things in. These are all like com compact hair brushes, which are Disney and then regular ones. Super, super cute. Um, a lot more brushes. These are like empty containers for soap and things. 
They didn't really have anything like lotions or soaps. Um, these are some portable, like, utensils. They had, of course, some cups, some cute little pride ones, and some little mugs over here. You're never going to guess who's coming up on my left. Um, oh, I cut that out, but more cute little kitchen stuff. There she is, the blonde that was literally always in everyone's way. Never looks at anything. <laughs> All right, so I'm making my way over. There is some pet toys and some little, I thought there was treats. There's not, um, leashes. And then they had this in the front of the store, which really got me excited on the way out. There's like a turkey leg one, a little taco lion, maybe? Moving over here, they did have some face masks, um, spa ones, and there are Disney options, which is super fun. And then more like just stuff for your spa day. And they had a claw machine, which was super fun. Don't have quarters, so I skipped that. You have some things for your nails. This aisle is just kind of like a bunch of random stuff. Wasn't that into it. You could see I'm kind of like making my way around. And then these are just super fun containers. Cute little mats over there. And then some storage bins. That's really cute of the Green Alien. It's kind of almost like a Cuddles, but it wasn't as big as the ones that we had. So I'm skipping that. Some little Legos there. And then um, they had a lot of little plushes. Oh, the girl is in front of me again. Like literally move. <laughs> so I came back to this aisle since they were blocking the entire aisle. There's Lotso, but I wanted to show you guys the options for the Winnie the Pooh ones because these were so cute. So I want the owl so bad. And then I'm just kind of showing the rest since that girl finally moved. Um, there is just some pens over here, some little toys. Heading back to the Toy Story section because duh. And I totally forgot to look at those wallets that I wanted to look at, but I'm showing the bag charm of the alien. And yeah. Okay, that was a very interesting experience. The line outside actually um, didn't take too long. It was like 10 minutes. And then, of course, when we went inside, or we, me, <laughs> when I went inside, it took a lot longer because... I had to look at everything and I wanted to film just so you guys could see what's there. There are a few more stores opening. So um, I will show what I got at the end of this and then that will do it. So thank you for watching. If you like this video, give me a thumbs up and be sure to be on the lookout for our future Walt Disney World videos. We are going in July. So see you guys later. Bye. Okay, let's see what we got. So, of course, I had to get this green alien pillow. It's super soft and super adorable. Um, it was, I want to say, like $18, which is a little pricey, but still super cute. And then next, I got two of these Lotso pillows because one for John, one for me. They don't smell like strawberries. It's totally fine. But these are so cute, and I like that they're kind of like not as puffy so those will work great and then i had to get this alien i call it a fanny pack because it actually does work as a fanny pack it has like a crossbody uh, thing that actually will tighten so this is the lots of one i bought um i did it in a different video um so i'll link that short down below it was actually on instagram so see how easy those tighten and those sits it sits nice on your waist and then i got this cute little lotso bag charm even though he looks kind of angry but i just thought he was so cute and i mean it's lotso duh and then i got the little green alien one too i thought that would be cute we have a lot of toy story bags 
And then I did end up getting this 100 Dalmatians brush. I don't know if we're going to keep it or just maybe throw it in a giveaway or one of our live sales as a prize. So I did get two of these villain mystery boxes. I'm excited about all of the ladies. So um, that will be in a future video. And then I got two boxes of these Winnie the Pooh ones. Again, like I was saying, I want the owl and rabbit for Johnny. But all of them are really, really cute. These were very pricey, I will say. Um, I was not looking at the price because online I want to say there were $12 and then in store there were $15 which is like, ugh. But these are the princess ones as keychains. I will say, though, like, they do come from Asia, so, I mean, I guess I could get behind the price, but... So these are the Alien Remix ones. You have a bunch of different options there. And then they have even more options on the side, which is cool. Hopefully we get Lotso and Arlo. And then I did get three more boxes of these Toy Story ones. Spoiler alert, I did get two more online. Um, MinisoUSOnline.com. I'll link it down below if you want to check out the website. But I didn't get Lotso, so I'm hoping one of these three is Lotso. So thank you guys for joining, and let me know down below if you have a Miniso in your state.